if the other one works, you know, they're just letting me know ten, five or ten minutes in so that I don't burn my Wi-Fi. Uh, so, all right. Cool, man. Bye. Two the morning, okay, so just stand by. Alright, you can see the podium here. Okay. No questions. No questions will be taken. Good afternoon. I'm Dave Ehrenberg, State Attorney for the 15th Judicial Circuit, which covers all of Palm Beach County. I'm joined today by my Chief Assistants, Al Johnson, Chief Assistants Adrian Ellis, and Brian Fernandez. Today, the grand jury completed its review of the use of force by Officer Newman Raja, which resulted in the death of Corey Jones. Chief Assistants Brian Fernandez and Adrian Ellis presented the evidence before the grand jury. The grand jury today found that the use of force by Mr. Raja was unjustified. Pursuant to this finding, this office has charged Mr. Raja with two counts. One count of manslaughter by culpable negligence, which is a second degree felony punishable by up to 15 years in prison and one count of attempted first degree murder with a firearm, which is a life felony punishable by up to life in prison. Mr. Raja has been arrested and taken into custody. We are making available to the public a copy of the probable cause affidavit, which outlines the pertinent portions of the investigation and findings. 
We'd like to thank everyone who assisted in this investigation, including our law enforcement partners, especially the Palm Beach County Sheriff's Office, the FBI, and the United States Marshal Service. We have notified representatives of the Corey Jones family about the grand jury's decision and our subsequent charges. Because this is now a pending case, I am not permitted to make any further extrajudicial comments and therefore cannot take any questions at this time. I appreciate your understanding as we now move forward to the next stage of this matter. Thank you. Natalie has copies of the probable cause affidavit. You're welcome to take your time if you need to use the space here without much. 